Hey guys, Georgia Soundtracks here. This week in our video, we're going to talk about servicing the locomotive and all the extra sounds that we put into the Tsunami 2 so that now your hostlers and your roundhouse crew can have a little bit more to do than simply pulling a locomotive out. So let's get started. Now with our locomotive, function 16 is enabling the sound of the water stop. And this is the sound of the water pouring out of the water tank. Function 17 is fuel loading. And so depending on what type of fuel you've selected for your locomotive, that type of fuel sound will play as if it's being loaded into the tender. And then function 18 is going to be cleaning the fire or shaking the grates. Now with our Tsunami 2, these sounds are already enabled with your throttle and your decoder. Now we're going to show you how you can do that with our simulated yard work right here. So first off, we're going to go ahead and top off the water. So we're going to bring our locomotive out. We're going to release the brakes. And now our locomotive is going to coast to a stop. And we can use the brakes to stop the locomotive right under the water tower. So now once we're stopped under the water tank, we're going to enable function 16 and you're going to hear the sound of the water tank open and then water pouring into it. And this will run as long as function 16 is enabled. So after a little while, we have say we've topped off our tender. So now we're going to turn off function 16. You're going to hear the water stop and you're going to hear the tender hatch close. All right. Now that we've done watering, next we have to fuel our locomotive. And in this case, we've got a coal burning locomotive. So let's go to the coal pit. Now with a little practice, you can get your brakes to stop you right where you need to be stopped. And that looks good right there. Now we're going to enable function 17 and you're going to hear the sound of coal pouring into the coal tender. And again, this will run as long as function 17 is enabled on your locomotive. So when we're done taking on coal, we turn off function 17. And you hear it stop. Next up, we're going to clean the fire. So we're going to shake the grates. So now we've got to go over our ash pit. So again, we're going to ring our bell. Start to move. And now remember, this is our fire in a firebox. So we need to stop with our firebox over the ash pit. Now that we've stopped over the ash pit, now we're going to go ahead and clean the fire. So with function 18 on, you'll hear the shaking of the grates. Now one of the other things you'll also hear is the air wand as it goes through and cleans up and blows out a lot of the ash. And again, this will run as long as function 18 is enabled when your locomotive is stopped. So now that we're done cleaning the fire, we turn to 18 off. Now our crew puts their tools away. And now we can go ahead and move on and go to the ready track because now our locomotive has been fueled, watered, and the fire's cleaned out. It's ready for its next trek across the layout. So we'll go ahead and move forward. And we're on our way. Now with all those extra sounds added in, how will you add those operations into your layout? For more information, please visit our website at Soundtracks.com and also be sure to check out the user's guide for more detailed information on how to set up your decoder.